OMFNG YouTube. What up and what's good party people? It is your host of the most, Paul Cantu, coming at you guys with the third attempt at making this video. So basically, iMovie, shout out to Mac and Apple for creating a suck ass program, has jacked up my video twice. I shot this video twice for you guys and I'm coming through for the trivecta for the win with this pickup bid. So sorry to rant on you guys, but basically what I have in this video is a conglomeration of pickups. This video is probably entitled, Dope Shit at Ross? Question mark, yes, period, bitch. So essentially what I have for you guys are Ross pickups with a little hint of Burlington Coat Factory dopeness and also a thrift store steal. So essentially all I want to do in this video is show you guys how to ball on a budget and look fresh by shopping at discount stores. I have three snapbacks, three packs of socks, and a special thrift store surprise for you guys. Sorry I had to cock back the neck and look at it because that thing is straight up neck breakingly sexy. The first item I got at Ross is a straight up gym. Literally peep the thread count on this straight up orange medallion of a snapback. Black crown, black brim, light gray underwear right there. Embossed Rick Rouse, diamonds on the back and a diamond tag. This thing is straight up a blood diamond from Mars. Like we went over there with our rovers full of freaking little robotic explorers popping caps up Martians asses and taking all their gems, throwing them on the corner of the block. That boy TV Johnny and Paul Wall straight making grills and icing out people in the disgrace state of Texas. That's why I'm flexing on you guys. Huh. This right here, that's what it is. It's a freaking Martian blood diamond. So the price point for these Martian diamonds are only $13.99. So straight up, Reedy Rose came through in the clutch with this Diamond Supply Co. snapback. So when I was going through the hats, I found this bad boy. I peeked to the right, I peeked to the left, then I go back to the right and I see the wall of socks. So don't get it twisted, don't get it construed, and don't get it misunderstood, guys. Ross's sock game is out the wazoo and it is straight unfuck -wittable. So the first pair of socks that just grabbed my attention were these bad boys. At first glance, I thought they were stance socks. Like, look at that. You see that straight up native print, but these are actually by Body Glove, and it is a three pack of socks that only costs $4.99. $5 for three pairs of dope ass, crazy freaking colored and printed on socks, actually wool embroidered. Your straight up grandmother was going ham in the basement making these bad boys for Rigby Rose. But yeah, these things are mad comfortable, mad dope designs. The first design, once again, this uh, native print. The second one is this like all orange sock with like gray on the top. I honestly don't know why you would wear these unless you're trying to attract Bugs Bunny and he'll like go ham gnawing on your anklets or ankles or cankles or whatever you got. And then the last pair is stripity stripity. You got the orange, the dark gray, yellow, white, once again orange, gray hits, and orange lipstick on the top. $4.99, sexy steal. Their side game is on point, guys, I'm telling you. So I already had to come through and through the selection get another pair of socks. The other pair are these badass basic resources. Yeah, that's what they're called. A basic resource three pack. So these bad boys came through in the clutch with kind of like a bread colorway. You got the skulls and crossbones on black right there, straight up going Blackbeard. Yo, Blackbeard, when he got assassinated by like some freaking like government agent, they put his head on a pike on top of the mask of mask, on top of the mast of the ship. That stuff is straight crazy. They said they threw his body overboard and it swam around the ship like 18 times. But uh, yeah, the next pair is Stripity Stripity as well. Gray, red, black, black on the tippity tab. And then we'll flip it over. The last pair has these black skulls right there. Red hits on the heel tab and then red on the top. And then the last pair is certainly the dopest. So this was a two pack for $3.99 and it is the straight up banana banane gamma blue navy hits on the top and on the heel section socks. Now these bad boys caught my attention first and they reminded me of some thrift store shorts that I saw a couple days back. So when I saw these bad boys I was like damn there were monkey shorts at the thrift. So as you guys know straight after I caught these I got in the truck straight up went 120 and a 30 and got to savers stat. And what did I cop at savers? I copped these bad boys. As you can see, we got some Gorilla Champanzee hybrid baboon bunny babies right here. These Gorilla shorts 
straight up with braces. As you can see, these bad boys got crosses in their teeth, looking like some like chimpanzee Illuminati figures and stuff. But yeah, these shorts are straight up sexy. They were $3.99 Banana Flow by Flow Society, a lacrosse brand, randomly enough. And as you can see, you got like little like hold on you got like little monkeys right here like these little like monkey like shadows and these things straight up remind me of the like barrel of monkey monkeys of Toy Story you guys know what I'm talking about like the ones whose arms like interlocking can build like Golden Gate bridges but on some real talk shit those monkeys are like the scariest like creature or like toy to come alive because if you don't play with them like if you put them that barrel of monkeys in like the back of your closet them hoes are gonna come out when they get pissed off enough and they'll straight up just encrush your body and suffocate you like a mad swarm of freaking rainforest ants bruh and then on the back of them you got a big ass banana going all the way back black on the back these things look like boxers so be careful wearing them in public if you want a pair they're $14.99 new so that actually is pretty cheap but honestly who would legit rock these aside from like my crazy ass? Next up on the chopping block, we have a Burlington Co Factory pickup. You guys may have seen this in my last trip to the thrift, but it is this Hall of Fame of Mitchell and Ness Splizdash. As you can see, white crown with a Gulf oil spill like slash going across it on top of the pine green forest. So just know this forest is straight up covered and dosed and doused in oil. You better be careful, Smokey the Bear, if you lighten that fat ass blunt because you're going to set the whole thing ablaze. Real talk. On the bottom, you have uh, this light gray underwear right there. It says Hall of Fame, all embroidered, nice little touch. Mitchell Ness green embroidery, nice little touch once again. And then you have the flag with second sucks because if you ain't first, you last. And what's even better about this hat, once again, is that price point. $9.99 for a Mitchell and Ness. This thing freaking looks sexy and peep game. I think it fits sexy too. I don't know, you guys tell me in the comment section below. Now last but certainly not least, I have a plunder pickup. I do occasionally dabble in plunder, get some dope shit. However, I don't make videos about them typically, but this one plunder pickup I have to mention because it is sick and it is bitching in the kitchen. And it is this straight up Colt 45 popping a cap up your bandito ass with smoke coming out the freaking barrel. This thing is dope as hell. It is by 40 ounce right there and it has the state of Texas embroidered in white on the side. You know I'm from Texas, riding slabs, reckless. So yeah, I had to come through, I had to get this bad boy, it matches a Houston Astros jersey that I actually do have. And I think this thing is sexy. Black snaps, green under brim. However, plunder, I do have some qualms with you guys. So number one, or plunder, or 40 ounce, I don't know. Actually, let's get into 40 ounce first. 40 ounce, what is this? Like, this is the most tiny ass embroidery ever. And 40 ounce, how are you giving like Texas their due justice with that tiny ass like embroidery? Texas is like one of the largest states in the United States. Like it would be the largest if we didn't freaking purchase Alaska. But this thing is straight up tiny. However, I still think it's a dope hat, but now we're getting into plunder. Plunder, you straight up crushed this hat, bruh. Like I don't know who put it in that tiny ass box. This thing was straight up like destroyed. It looked like it got smashed by a sledgehammer. So real talk plunder, you need to step up your packaging game because it is shit. And just know I got on that survey and I was like, dear plunder, you suck dick. But yeah, those are essentially all the pickups. Hopefully you guys enjoy. Let's get the uh, video cover right now. But yeah, you can find once again really dope streetwear snapbacks for cheap at discounted stores. So don't be hesitant about shopping there. Once again, as I preach and profess in all my vids, sorry I'm spitting and shit. But you guys do not have to spend a lot of money to look fresh and to look dope. You feel me? But no, seriously, I really appreciate all the mad love and support you guys have provided. If it wasn't for y'all, I wouldn't still be doing this. So real talk, thank you guys for the love and support. Hopefully one day I'll get like a thrift sponsored haul or like a sponsored like monkey short haul or something. So yeah, just keep sticking with me guys. I really appreciate all the love and support. Once again, if you have anything you would like to tell me, any conversations you would like to start, leave them in the comment section below because the whole point of this YouTube thing is for me to communicate with you guys, me to share a little bit of knowledge, my personality, my craziness, and my style. So once again guys, you don't have to spend a butt ton of money YouTube on items. I know these other YouTubers are picking up new sneakers every day, like all these expensive ass garments, and you might be thinking if you're a kid, dude, I need to buy that to look fresh. I need to buy, you don't. You honestly don't. Go to thrift stores, go to these discount stores, put yourself together in a nice few little like outfits and shit, and you'll be looking fresh. You'll be stunning in the club, getting all them third grade bitches, maybe a substitute teacher, maybe Miss Gonzalez, who knows. But uh, yeah, once again, your host of the most, Pocket 2, signing out. Leave a like, comment, be a subscriber. You guys are awesome. Peace. <laughs>
and just know I move you bet not to fuck this one up. Cause this is money. Money. One take wonder. Peace. <laughs>